you make a farm or ranch more sustainable? There's no single answer, but there are common practices used by producers across the country to improve profitability, quality of life, and environmental stewardship. In this episode, we'll take a look at cover crops and soil health. Farmers everywhere are learning the importance of improving the health of their soil. Planting a cover crop is one of the best ways to get there. Including cover crops in our crop rotations helps us build soil structure and fertility, protect water quality, suppress pests, and improve the bottom line. The benefits are more pronounced when we use cover crops and reduce tillage together. We can manage soil nutrients more efficiently by using the right cover crops. For example, plant legume cover crops before heavy feeder crops to supply them with nitrogen. After harvest, follow with a grass cover crop to scavenge excess nutrients and reduce leaching into waterways. Living cover crop roots hold the soil together to slow erosion and even help break up compacted soils. Cover crop residues add organic matter to soil, improving water holding capacity, water infiltration, and aeration. Soils high in organic matter can better retain moisture during hot, dry years and absorb excess rain in wetter years. These soils also have abundant microorganisms that cycle nutrients and suppress disease. Cover crops also help manage pests, including herbicide-resistant weeds. Leaving a mat of cover crop residue smothers weeds, cutting herbicide costs. Cover crops can pay for themselves within the first few years by cutting input costs and providing modest yield boosts. Their value increases when grown for seed or as forage for livestock. Over the long term, they help us build resilient cropping systems. There's much more to learn about cover crops. Start exploring today.